Today we celebrate a dessert that hails from Scotland, a buttery, dense, melt-in-your-mouth treat that dates back centuries and is still a favorite today. It's January 6th, and today is National Shortbread Day. Welcome to Taco Cast Podcast, every day's a holiday. No, really, it is. Did you know that literally every day is a holiday? I don't know about you, but I love having a reason to celebrate every day. Whether it's your favorite foods day or something else totally random, happy holiday to you. Shortbread's original recipe that dates back to the 12th century calls for a simple mix of butter and flour. It started as a kind of biscuit bread, which was made from leftover dough from making bread. The fattening of the dough quote, shortens it, giving this treat the name shortbread. Shortbread is baked without a leavening component, baking soda or powder, that lends to the dense texture. Shortbread was a luxury food for most, served at special occasions like weddings, and for the new year, a tradition that dates to ancient Yule cakes that symbolize the sun. Even to this day, there are still some who refer to it as first footers at New Year's. The food is also heavily tied to Mary Queen of Scots of the 16th century century who had a taste for petticoat tails, a thin buttery shortcake flavored with caraway seeds. When sugar was introduced to the UK in the 17th century, shortbread was a sweet biscuit often enjoyed with evening tea. Shortbread is traditionally made in three distinct shapes, petticoat tails, one large circle that's divided into different segments, shortbread rounds, individual round biscuits, and fingers, thick rectangular slabs. Shortbread is a popular souvenir from Scotland, so on this day, it's a great day to try your hand at this simple recipe. Just butter, sugar, and flour is all you need to make a shortbread cookie. You can also enjoy some other Scottish dishes. For the brave, go with some haggis, or others might just prefer some whiskey. Happy holiday, everyone, and I'll see you tomorrow.